Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of Ignite with me, where today we're looking at the Arturo Fuente uh, Oro, and so this is going to be something that um, we haven't been told to find cigars to so I think um, this one right here is, it had a gold wrapper over it, I'm not sure that that's all of them though, um, I, need to, I need to check and make sure that, and I'm, I'm pretty sure we have it and other other vitolas at least but i did want to show it to you okay so this one right here is a really good one so far okay another reminder of why arturo fuente is one of the top brands in cigars so <coughs> there's some floral taste notes right off the bat so those floral taste notes are going to be some of the best floral taste notes i've ever tasted um that's very pronounced on this. There's some nuttiness, and there's also what they described, what I read in the taste note review, is kind of a lemon cake. Yeah, kind of. I could see that. Kind of a lemon cake. Not too strong on the lemon side of things, but... It's manageable. So if you're like me and you don't like something like lemon icebox pie or something like that, I don't think this will be too big of a problem. There is some earthiness there, some creaminess. And also, yeah, there's, there's the taste of acorns. So yeah, the review I read was, was accurate. I have my doubts about that, <laughs> about this review, but I wanted to review this. Hmm. The meatiness is the one thing I can't taste. There are cigars, there's a Rocky Patel cigar that has a meat kind of taste note. Uh, it's kind of like a raw meat taste note. This is not that. I don't, I don't have that kind of taste note coming from this. But um, come by Vitola, find cigars, Tuscusa, pick one of these bad boys up, and let me know what you think in the comment section below. Hope you have a great day. Bless.